Hi, my name is David. Today we're going to do number 557, reverse words in a string, part three. So you're given a string and then you have to reverse it, but the catch is there's a space here. So you have to reverse each word, but then have the space be consistent. So how are we going to solve this one? Is that we need to turn these the string into an array, an array separated by the space. So the first thing we can do is that we create word variable to split the S string into an array separated by space, by an empty space, which is what we need. And the next thing we do is that we'll have to loop through, we, we create an array for each of these, and now we have to loop through them and reverse the words. So we wanna create reverse word variable to loop through the word to loop through each word in the array. Okay, and once we're looping through this array, we have to, so it's gonna be a string, but we need to use the, we can use the reverse method in JavaScript, but that reverse method is only for arrays. So we have to turn it to an array. So split the current So split each element in the array by an empty, by us nothing. And after that, we will have to reverse each element. And then we join, join each element up by the empty parentheses empty quotations to put them back together. So that will get this to be reversed to this. And now we have to join, but there's gonna be a array of that. So now we have to join it all together. Let me put this as a C. Join the reverse word by an empty space. Okay, so let's put it in code. So first one we do, we create the word variable that word equals to s dot split and an empty space. Nice. So now we have the array. So now we can loop through this array by creating a new variable that reverse word equals to word dot map. We're gonna loop it through for each element. What we're gonna do is that we're gonna turn it into an array by split. And then we reverse it and then we join it back up again. Nice. And now we have to return reverse word by the empty space. Submit. Okay, so we got the answer. So the, the complexities So the complexities is that the time complexity will be O of N 
squared since we have to, we're looping through this and then we're having to do these methods inside of it where it's proportional to how long each of these words in are in this element. And now this space complexity will be O of N because we're creating these variables that are proportional to however long our input is. And that is how you solve this problem. Thank you.